Alright, so we're gonna go through a few memories throughout your career. I got, got a few moments here. Um, obviously, you started with Penske in that number 12, so yep. here's your first memory here. Okay. So, so this photo would have had to have been taken from Phoenix. Mm -hmm. Is that correct? I think so. Uh, so, this would have been my third NASCAR start. So I had one in Charlotte, um, I had one in Texas, mm -hmm. and then I had one here in Phoenix. So, uh, I think we ran okay that, that night, but uh, definitely cool. I, I remember this car very well. I love that car. Yeah. That's an interesting one. That is an interesting one. So, Rookie of the Year. Um, Joey Logano's in that picture. Yeah, yeah. Johnny Sauter's in that picture. That's that was really cool. That was a you know those jackets. It's funny because you. I don't feel like that's a jacket you would ever wear out, right? Yeah. But I I have a, uh, I'm fortunate enough to have a few jackets that were made as trophies or or different things like this awards, and you hang them in the closet and you don't ever really know what to do with it because yeah. I want to put them on display, but then on the same time, they're uh, they're just they're just cool looking cool looking jackets. Uh. And now we're going early into your cup career. Now you're in the 51. We are just second cup start. This is, yeah, so Chicago was first. Mm -hmm. This was second. Um, yeah, this photo is funny because we had a lot of speed. I think we were top 10 in practice. Yeah. And I crashed so hard in the race. Yeah. Like it was terrible. And uh, Newman, right? Yeah, it hurt. Well, I actually crashed and then Newman had nowhere to go and yeah. hit me. That one hurt really bad. Mm -hmm. So. Not a good, not a, it was a good memory, but but also it ended badly, so. Welcome to come. Right. <laughs> right there, that's another bad one, I guess. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's actually my teammate now, Michael Lynette, mm -hmm. uh, kind of behind me. I think Reed Sorensen's yep. the one up underneath me. Yeah. Daytona, that would have been 2012? I believe so, yes. Yeah. Uh, I remember that one very well because I actually thought that I was going to flip over forwards. Uh, you know, the crash started and it was all, you know, kind of happening quickly. And Kenny Wallace is the black car here in front yeah. of me. He got turned up in front of me, and I hit him. And then Reed Sorensen hit me from behind. And I can just remember thinking, I'm, I'm gonna flip over forwards. And I've never had that experience, so wow. not a good one. Yeah, let's get a little positive here. Yeah, double memory here. Double memory. Uh, you know, this this photo actually for me is probably one of the coolest victory lane photos uh, because I feel like, you know. In, this one, not that the others didn't mean a lot, but what this one meant, like having a couple years without having a win, and not sure if you're gonna get back to victory lane. This one, uh, this was just a cool day, a cool win, and uh, and Dale coming to the coming to the car, you know, what I mean, he was the, basically the first one to get to me once we got to victory lane, and seeing his excitement, yeah, that was that was really cool to me. It's something that you don't. You don't normally get, you know, you know, those opportunities don't come every week. And uh, so that was that was really, really cool. Yeah, absolutely. Final couple here. Yeah. My wife and I at Bristol, mm -hmm. um, getting ready to get in the car. That's, uh, that's a really cool one. Yeah. I actually think that's the day we won the race. That was, that, that was my first win day. And uh, that was really cool. Yeah. So, and Roger was there that day. Mm -hmm. He was up on the uh, the spotter stand, and I can remember him talking to us on the radio. And uh, he talked to Brad and I both. We were teammates, Brad Keselowski and I were teammates. And he's like, "All right, guys, you know, I, I want the best car to win, but he's like, don't just don't wreck each other. That's all I ask." And uh, you know, we were fortunate enough to battle it out and, and to come home as a winner. So that was that was really really cool. So looking back on all your career, now how how thankful are you? You look back on these memories, good, bad, ugly, but you know, you you're able to have a career in NASCAR, so what does it mean to you to be to be this thankful, to be this lucky to be in NASCAR? You know, I don't I don't know that there's words that can describe it. I mean, you know, for me, I look at the opportunities that I've had and, and you know, there's been some good and some bad, but I think the bad ones make you appreciate the good ones that much more. And I think that, you know, in life, um, you know, when I was five years old and, and I started racing cars, the only thing that I cared about was I wanted to make it to NASCAR and be a NASCAR driver. And, you know, not that not that there aren't thousands of kids that say that same thing. Um, so I think for me that I, I, I don't take that for granted that, that I was one of the, the, the lucky ones that was able to make it. Mm -hmm. But I think the other part of it is um, I look at my, my dad and my mom what they sacrificed to, to be able to make that happen. I remember you know, 
my dad driving hours and hours and hours uh, to go get parts or to get pieces and to, to, to do things because we couldn't afford to do it the way everybody else did it. We had to go try and find that used part that you had to search, you know, to, to China to find. It was like, you know, no matter what happened, my dad was always the one that was yeah. pushing. And then, and then after that, you know, my wife, um, my wife was a huge part of you know, making this happen. I mean, she, um, she kind of took over and, and ran a lot of the, the, helped with a lot of the race team and made sure that I was, you know, focused and doing what I needed to do. So it's like, you know, it's just a family effort. It's, it's been really cool. Yeah, absolutely. Definitely appreciate your time. Yeah, awesome absolutely. memories, man. Thank you very Thank you much. Appreciate it. Too. Yep. Thank you. Thank you.